Good morning, friends. It's 63 of 100. This is Amanda Roberts. And whew, so I actually was going to go live last night at like midnight and my phone kept acting up because I am so freaking busy. Uh, I want to come on here really quick because I have committed to 100 lives in 100 days. And really, you know, like it's funny how the facets of my journey to figuring it out and to becoming and unbecoming the person that maybe I was or am into the person that I know I'm supposed to be and to follow the purpose that I know has been placed on my life. It's like I set out in January to, to get into the place to be the best place mentally, physically, emotionally, like all the way around. But I didn't really embark on it until February 1st, right? And February 1st, all I started was the physical transformation, which I'd been on a physical journey since 2016 when my thyroid gave out, but I was struggling. And so it wasn't until February 1st when I joined F45 that it really cranked it up. And then through some personal, you know, relationships and things of that nature it was in april that i decided to to embark on my first unstoppable influencer challenge and i really didn't know what i was going to get out of that other than the fact that i felt really lost in life and if you're a human we all have those experiences we all have those periods of our life where we may feel lost and that's okay. It's a matter of whether or not you're gonna stay there or you're gonna do something about it. And I knew that it was my time to embark on something bigger. And so with that, in the beginning, you know, I, I started to figure things out, but it wasn't until June. And it was removing things from my life. So literally, <clears throat> since Saturday, I've been purging my house because I know what I'm supposed to do. I it scares the crap out of me. <clears throat> and in order to do it, I need everything in my life to be completely organized and streamlined because here in the next couple of weeks, I am going, I, I'm already so busy, but it's going to be a whole lot of work. And last night I had a almost two hour phone call with my other mom, um, like, just reality had struck last night and I knew that that was the person that I needed to talk to. And so the reality of it was I was being emotional and thinking that it was this reason, but the reality is it's, it's what I'm supposed to do scares me that much. And she's like, when you're in that place, that's when you have to move. So if there's something that's scaring the crap out of you, that means it's time to move out of your comfort zone and go do it. But for me, it means a whole lot of work, a whole lot of work, because I know that I've been called to serve others and help people um, while, while generating this new business. And so I'm not gonna give too much away. I keep saying, it's like, I know the bow that's on top of the package, but I don't know all the contents yet because I gotta go create it. And my dream has been for at least four years now to help monthly 500 women make a, an extra thousand dollars a month. And I never could figure out how, and now I know how. And it doesn't mean that I have some magic potion or anything like that. It's literally, I've been blessed to know a lot of things and have success and that is going to come to the forefront. So that's just the cliff notes, very brief because I've got to go get busy. I've got to finish my house because I've got to, I've set aside two or three hours today that I need to go write. Um, it scares the crap out of me to know that I need to write, but it's what I've been called to do. It's something that I know that I need to embark on. And with that, I hope you guys have a great Tuesday. It's going to be an amazing day and just stay tuned and continue to watch these lives every day because big, big things are happening. So with that, you guys have a great and amazing Tuesday.